I'm Salim Sabri. I'm the event director here at AIM. Uh, we also have on the call today, uh, Nicole Perino. She's our creative director. Uh, we yes. just want to I just want to take a moment to just welcome you all and thank you all for, um, you know, just your constant unwavering support of AIM, the Brokers of Better family. Um, this is going to be uh, a great, amazing experience next week with AIM Fuse 2020. We can't wait to share with you just all the great content um, and just the, the connectivity and networking opportunities that we have available for you. Um, I know this is a little different than what you're used to at AIM events, but um, not to fear, you know, we're still going to maintain uh, that same kind of level of connection. Um, and we do have some receptions going on across the country too. So be sure to take a look out for that. Um, those are on our website. You can check those out too. They're happening. There'll be post event receptions, but without any further ado, we'll uh, show you guys to our wonderful platform. It's called Swap Card. Um, I encourage everyone to log into their Swap Card platform. Um, you should have received an email directly letting you know how to get in there. You should have just had to go in and create a password and then you would have been able to start creating your, your profile. So it actually Nicole showing you what it looks like when you first log in, but it might be helpful for you to just follow along and be in the platform. So you can actually do some of the things Nicole's getting ready to show you. And um, lastly, if you do have any questions, uh, we're going to try to answer them all at the end. Hopefully we answer most of them through the demo, but feel free to throw them in the chat and uh, we'll be sure to get those answered. So welcome to AIMFUSE 2020 and on the virtual swap card platform. Woohoo! So yeah, um, like you said, if, if everyone has their login and you can follow along and actually click through, that's gonna be the best way to learn yourself hands-on and you'll probably run into some questions and then you can pop them in the chat here and we can answer them. So here we are inside Swapcard, AIMFUSE 2020 virtual platform. First thing I would suggest is to set up your profile. So if we go over here, you can add a picture, you can add your title, your company, you can add special skills so that um, this will allow people to search for you by, by your skill set or by you know, a specific type of thing that you wanna connect with them on. You can also add your social media handles. It, it pre-populates them for you. So you don't have to worry about putting the facebook.com, just the slash that goes after it. So if you go up here in the, in the URL, oh, sorry, let me turn on my, my oh, I don't have my mouse highlighter. Um, if you go up into your uh, Facebook profile, it's just the back at the slash, everything after the slash. Of course, phone number, email address, website, you wanna put all this too. Think of this as like your virtual business card. So people are gonna connect with you similar to Facebook or LinkedIn. They're gonna friend request you, connect with you and all your information that we have an access here. Your company, you can link your company as well. Okay, so we go back to the home. Now you can navigate through the platform by either these buttons right here or by this bar up top here. That'll get you all around. First thing would be um, our schedule. Now, anything you want to, you, anything you want to sort of bookmark that's in the agenda. You're like, I don't want to miss that at 2:30 p.m. I gotta see it. You're gonna bookmark that, and it's gonna add to your schedule. So if we click on my schedule here, um, I have some things. It's a how to use swap card demo over here. I've bookmarked it, so it shows up in my schedule. I also have a meeting booked. Um, on Friday, September 25th. So that also shows up in my schedule as a confirmed meeting. And then a bunch of other sessions here that I've bookmarked to watch. How do we see the agenda? Next button here, agenda. Now remember there's at almost every time in the day, there's two things you can watch at any given time. So the first thing here is 11 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. for you guys on the West Coast, we have two different panels to choose from. Now, like I was just saying about bookmarking, you can click this little orange dot over there, little calendar icon, and you even see over here my schedule is, uh, is changing and it's you know populating for me. Now, just one note here for everyone. You're like, okay, well, I don't want to miss Laura Brindale while the, uh, the WMN panel is going on. There's 
that's why it's great to have this platform because all of this content will live on the platform after the event. You can come back, watch things. It'll be live through the following weekend. So you got about not 10 days or so to see all of this content. Yep. So say it'll basically, uh, once the stuff airs live, think of it as a, a YouTube platform where you can go back and watch the session that you missed. So you can still bookmark it. If you want to see both of them at the same time, feel free to bookmark them both. They'll both show up in your schedule, but the one that you actually want to watch right now, um, you will just click on it. Um, nothing's going to populate now because it's nothing's live, but this will be your video window box. So just to show you what it looks like when you are watching something live, um, we'll go to, we'll go to an older video that's in here. Now, as you're watching something that's happening live, and I'll just mute this, you can also navigate through the platform. You can chat with people, you can search for attendees, you can search exhibitors, you can do all this different stuff while the video is still playing. Um, so here it is. All you have to do is maybe click over here to your notifications. People that have requested you. If you want to go to the private chat, here we are chatting with Sam Parker. Uh, and here's your box. Uh, here's your video box over here. Now I just have to move my zoom. So you can take this and you can take this and sort of drag it anywhere on the screen that you want. So you won't miss a beat, but you can also be keeping up with your notifications and your chatting with people. Another thing you can do, and it, it won't work properly because we're on Zoom, but you can video chat with people. Um, so you would just click this icon um, and then it's going to pop up with your webcam. So you can do one on one video chatting with people while you're watching sessions live. Okay, our next tab we have is speakers. We can see every single person who's scheduled to speak live on Friday the 25th. And if you wanted to friend request them, you can just click this little person icon with the plus sign. And it's going to say, um, it's gonna give me Skylar's profile here. It'll also give you meeting times if I wanna request a time to meet with her one-on-one -on -one video chat. So if I want to say 3.30 PM, online meeting, and I can even say, hey, and send the meeting request. Okay, and you can do that with as many people as you want throughout the whole day. That's with, the that's with um, speakers. Now, you can do the same thing with any attendee that's in the platform. Same thing, add them as a friend, request a meeting with them. Now, what about exhibitors? First things first, um, in, in the live watch now section, all of this content is our on demand content. So this is not, this is not live. This is demos that uh, our brokers are better network partners have uploaded. There's also a how to use the demo that we've uploaded from our YouTube channel. So right now today, if you log in with uh, your swap card login, you will be able to start watching stuff and connecting with people today. So you can get ahead of it. You don't have to wait until Friday the 25th. So in here, I see, um, why should I subscribe to mortgage currency? I can click on that. And this is a video from one of our brokers or better network partners, mortgage currency. Okay. Here's the video. And then I can see who is connected. Um, or who, which attendees have watched this, I guess. Oh no, I'm sorry. That is, um, yeah. The, uh, yeah. You're or like have added it to their schedule. Correct. Okay. So like, it looks like Nick Castronova has watched this video already. So woohoo. So I can connect with him. Hey, what do you think about mortgage currency? Um, something like that. Okay. Um, now, if I want to connect with mortgage currency, I watched this video. I really love them. I want to schedule a one-on-one -on -one video chat with them. I'm going to go to exhibit hall. Okay. And I can scroll down to brokers, a better network and I will see mortgage currency, okay? I can click on their virtual exhibit booth. I can see information about them. Uh, I can see why AIM recommends them, what, they, what their specialty is, where they're located, a website, and also their social media and any documents that they've uploaded. So 
all of our um, lender sponsors, AIM approved lender sponsors, Brokers of Better Network, all have uploaded content, documents, all the good stuff in here for you guys. So even more of a reason to get in here before Friday the 25th, because then you can just enjoy the event on Friday. But get in here before, sniff around, see what's there for you, see, um, see who you want to connect with. Um, so it looks like they have some details and examples here. It's a document. If I click on it, um, it's going to just download to my computer. Oh. Okay, so back to the exhibit hall. And I will go back to mortgage currency, click on their booth, and I'll do a meeting with them at 12.45 p.m. Online meeting. Okay, send meeting request. And now you'll see this meeting is pending right here. It should also show up in my, if I click on my schedule, remember we bookmarked um, pieces of the agenda that we wanted to make sure we saw and that on our schedule, we also have my meetings. So there's one that I have confirmed. There's, it also shows this meeting that I have pending. You can also set which time, I believe, right, Salim? You can set which times you are available to meet with other people. Yep, just by clicking that link right under there. So if there's any time that you definitely want to be watching content and not meeting, or you know you won't be on the platform for whatever reason, you can make yourself unavailable, and then that time frame will not show on your profile as a time to request. Perfect. So it looks like here I'm available at all these times. So maybe I want to say at 10 a.m. I am not available. So here at 10 a.m., I would say make unavailable and it grays it out. So now if Salim goes to try to connect with me as an attendee, he won't be able to do it at 10 a.m. Okay. Yeah. I think that's it. Uh, for the most part, <laughs> it looks like, <laughs> I know there's probably yeah. more specific questions. So let me check this chat box to see. Well, I, I've actually been answering a couple. Um, okay. We actually haven't had too many questions, so please let us know. Uh, a lot of the questions here are, um, is there a swap card login separate from the Fuse login? And, and the answer is yes. Um, once you purchase your ticket, uh, I know a bunch of people have already had tickets, so you should have gotten that email from swap card. If you haven't yet, and I'm going to put this in the chat, you can email info at aimgroup.com, and we'll get that sorted out for you. Um, anyone who's purchasing a ticket today or going forward typically takes about 24 hours from when you purchase your ticket to the uh, email you'll get directly from swap card. So I see Lisa saying that she's purchased her ticket. So Lisa, we'll make sure to get you logged in. Um, if you want to just, if you could just shoot us an email to info at aimgroup.com, we'll make sure you get logged into swap card. Perfect. Okay. It seems like I also put good. Yeah, I also put the link um, in the chat on how to log in. So I know some of the folks are saying that they haven't received their uh, email. That That is possible, but definitely just give a click on the link and try to log in with the email that you think you used when you bought your ticket. Um, if that doesn't work, info at aimgroup.com and we'll make sure to get you logged in. Yeah, that's right. Because doesn't it do the the magic link thing? It's sort of correct so can so if we just give them it, it is a very simple process i mean yeah you just um it just prompts you with your email address and then you can create a password really easy so we have one more question okay. in here how long will we have access to swap card so you should have it starting to you know today if you have a ticket and for those who don't we'll get you situated and then you'll have access to the platform uh through the following weekend um after fuse so not exactly sure how many days that is as of today, but you know, yeah, 10 uh, plus two. It's about, whatever. about yeah. It's yeah, a lot. About, it's a bunch, yeah. About two weeks in there that you'll have access. Oh yeah, edit the comp edit the company info. So if in your you're personal profile. Yeah. If you're um if your company doesn't have necessarily a booth or um like a profile themselves. You would just add it up top here, I believe. Yes. So I, yeah, we just have job title and then. So for me, my company says let's connect. You could you, you could do that if you want. Um, I just did that so people would kind of see it. 
it's similar to how like you use LinkedIn headers where like it appears under your name, wherever your profile goes, you have that little blurb that's under your name. So you could edit it right here and I could just say aim. Oh, a note on here. You don't have to hit save. You can just type um, and it automatically saves. We have All another right. question here. Someone's asking, can I leave the platform during the event and pop back in and watch more? Absolutely. Oh yeah. Um, you could watch it. You can leave and want, come back and catch it live. If you're in time, you can come back the next day um, yep. or through the following weekend. Saturday morning, Sunday morning, Monday, Tuesday, a whole 10 days after. Yeah. And if something is going on live um, and you come back in the middle of it, you can click to watch it. But as soon as it finishes, a little bit of time to buffer, but it will be available a little bit after it airs. Um, you can also just go back and watch the whole thing. We have another question that's asking, what devices can I watch Fuse from? So that is an awesome question. Uh, this link, once you get logged into your platform, it is just a hyperlink. It's, it's a web browser. So you, know, you can watch it on any laptop or desktop device. We also have an app. So it's the AIM Fuse 2020 mobile app on both uh, iOS and Google Play. So you can go right in there, it's free to download. Um, and it's essentially gonna look just like this, but uh, mm -hmm. you know, on, on your condensed for your phone. Um, so you can really watch this on the go uh, or, or anywhere that you need to be. Yep. Okay. I think, um, I think that's good. Are there any more questions out there? I think I've answered everyone's. Sorry if I didn't, please let me know. Pop up. Yeah. I'm looking at the chat and the... Uh... Yeah, I, I think I answered these live. <laughs> okay, good. All, they are Eastern, yes. Everything's Eastern time. So the whole day will start at... Well, the sessions will start at 8.30 a.m. West Coast Pacific time. I'm, I'm, this is an actual just small correction there. So the event programming, the agenda that you'll see on there is set in East Coast time. But when you go to make your meetings, it will adjust to the time zone that you're in. So if you are on the West Coast and you have a, a 10 a.m. Eastern time meeting, it will show as 7 a.m. in your schedule. But when you go oh, to view the agenda, it will all show in Eastern time. Great. Programming Perfect. starts at 11.15 on Friday morning, Eastern time. That's a good note about the meetings though. Yeah, so you don't have to try to like figure it out. Everything on your schedule will be in your time zone. Okay. So All right, everyone. I guess yeah, yeah, I if anyone doesn't have their login, info at aimgroup.com or just Facebook us, Facebook message um, someone on the AIM team and definitely get logged in next week ahead of, ahead of Friday the 25th. Yeah, and there will be an AIM booth live on the day of, but just to assist with any questions you, excuse me, that you may have, but um, to Nicole's point, I definitely think it's good to get in there ahead of time, set some meetings up, make some connections. So you're kind of rolling and flowing by the day of the event. Yes. Love it. All right. Well, if there's no more questions, please um, let us know. As Nicole said, you can reach out uh, to us directly. Uh, info at aimgroup.com. Uh, we'll be sure to get your answer, your questions answered. Uh, and for anyone who's not logged into the platform uh, who should be, please let us know and we'll correct that immediately. Awesome. All right. Thank you guys. Talk to you soon. Thank you everyone. Have a good day. See you next week.